I am with the incredible Annette Benning. I'm so thrilled to talk to you today. Thank you. What was it about this project that really attracted you to it? Because you've done so many different kinds of films. Well, uh, just the chance to get to work on a Marvel movie. I was so excited at the prospect of it, the idea of it. And then when I read it, I thought, this is cool. I get to do some really fun stuff. And it has proved to be a joy. What is it that you look for in a character when you are like, maybe I'll take that role? Was, were there certain things in this that you were like, yeah, that crosses some T's and dots and I's? Well, I get to do more than one thing. There's a duality to what I do. Mm -hmm. So in some ways you think I'm kind of one thing, but I'm actually another thing. Part of what I do is I get to play the supreme intelligence. Mm -hmm. And within that, there's a lot of um, creativity, let's say. Mm -hmm. I'm sure a lot of people who know the Marvel world know who that is or what mm -hmm. that is. But in, in our story, um, the way that the supreme intelligence is embodied is new. What has it meant to you personally to get to be part of the first female-led solo Marvel film? Well, super fun. It's Brie Larson, who's a great actress mm -hmm. and someone that I had met before and I knew she would be terrific. Two great directors, Ryan and Anna, who are approaching it with their own you know, sensibility, their own sense of story and sense of humor and all of that. But yeah, the fact that, you know, women are stepping up and taking charge and taking charge mm -hmm. of the universe, that's definitely a good thing. Women in charge of the universe, I'm here for it. I, um, me too, I'm down. <laughs> what are you hoping fans come away feeling when they see this film? Ultimately, all these movies have great fun. It's mm -hmm. great fun, it's a great adventure. There's a lot of humor, there's a lot of, you know, wit in the movie. That's what I've always loved about these movies is they have such a great sense of humor. But at the core, there's a real hero's story. Go see Marvel Studios Captain Marvel in theaters now.